This short, simple guide to the element oxygen will provide facts and information for chemistry students who are learning about the periodic table and, in particular, the element oxygen. Each chemical element is given a unique chemical symbol which is used all over the world. The chemical symbol for oxygen is O. The chemical symbols of elements come from their English, Greek, or Latin names. The first letter of a symbol is always a capital letter, and if there are any subsequent letters, they are expressed in lower case. The name originates from the Greek oxys, for sharp, acid, because oxygen was believed to be the key constituent in the formation of acids, and the Greek words gen or genes, meaning forming, French chemist Antoine Laurent Lavoisier originally thought that oxygen was an acid producer because by burning phosphorus and sulfur and dissolving them in water, he was able to produce acids. All of the chemical elements are given a unique atomic number. The atomic number for oxygen is 8. Atoms are made up of three kinds of smaller particles called protons, neutrons, and electrons. The atomic number is the number of protons in the atom. The chemical elements of the periodic table are shown in order of atomic number and identified by their symbol. The periodic table is a chart showing the symbols and the atomic numbers of all known elements, such as oxygen, in one large grid. The chemical elements of the periodic table are placed in order of their atomic numbers. Atomic numbers increase as you move across a row, called a group, or down a column, called a period. The atomic number of oxygen is 8. The element symbol for oxygen is O. The discovery of oxygen is attributed to Joseph Priestley. In 1774, Priestley obtained the element by heating a compound of mercury and oxygen, known as red oxide of mercury. The element oxygen is one of over 100 different chemical elements that are known to modern chemistry. Each element is first identified at room temperature and pressure as being a solid, liquid, or gas, referred to as states of matter. Oxygen is a gas at normal room temperature and pressure. Each element has physical properties that can be observed and measured, such as color, density, and odor. The chemical properties are the characteristics that determine how a substance will react with other substances, such as water or oxygen. What is oxygen? In a general overview of the element, we can at first describe oxygen as a colorless gas. It is the most abundant element in nature and essential to life. Oxygen constitutes 21% of the atmosphere, and it is also found in water, in most rocks and minerals, and in numerous organic compounds. Oxygen can change from a gas to a liquid, taking on a slightly bluish color. Liquid oxygen can then be solidified or frozen. The more specific physical properties of oxygen can usually be observed using our senses or involve a numerical measurement, such as determining its boiling, freezing, and melting points. The physical properties of oxygen are color, colorless, phase, gas. It is tasteless and odorless. Crystalline structure, cubic. Density, it is denser than air. Conductivity, it is a poor conductor of heat and electricity. Solubility, slightly soluble in water, alcohol, and some other common liquids. Chemical properties are the characteristics that determine how oxygen will react with other substances when it is changed chemically. The chemical properties of oxygen are flammability, it does not burn. It supports combustion, but does not burn. It occurs in many compounds, including water, carbon dioxide, and iron ore. Oxides of some metals form peroxides by the addition of oxygen. Once the properties of an individual element have been identified, it is placed into a group of elements which have common properties and characteristics. Oxygen is in the group called the nonmetals. The seven elements classified as nonmetals are located in groups 1, 14, 15, and 16 in the periodic table. The names of the nonmetals are hydrogen, carbon, nitrogen, oxygen, phosphorus, sulfur, and selenium. The nonmetals are elements that do not look like metals. They are poor electrical and thermal conductors, but are great insulators. Nonmetallic elements exist at room temperature as gases, such as oxygen, and also as solids, such as carbon. Once the properties of an element have been established, we then have the ability to identify how it can be used. Pure cylinder oxygen is used for breathing at high altitudes, during space flights, and in underwater navigation. People who have trouble breathing use oxygen masks and tanks to help them get the oxygen they need. Oxygen also plays an important role in metal production, especially steel, but also copper, lead, and zinc. Oxygen is essential to life. In the process of respiration, the air is taken into the lungs, where a certain amount of oxygen is absorbed by the blood. 
It is then carried to all parts of the body, oxidizing the worn out tissues to be eliminated from the body. The heat generated by this oxidation is the source of the heat of the body. The properties of oxygen are classified by many other factors, including the melting point, boiling point, atomic mass, and density of the element. All of these precise measurements, together with additional facts and information, can be found on our website. So ends our simple guide to the element oxygen. We have created a unique collection of videos on many other important elements that have been developed to enable chemistry students to gain a fast overview of the properties of each of the elements together with their discovery and history. Check out our easy video guides to the elements via our website.